driving along, I get a sense of discreet solidarity. A feeling that I'm driving something distinct, yet presentable. This is the 2007 Audi A4 sedan. Falling in line, this is a B7 series A4. This car features options such as Quattro, Audi's praised all-wheel drive system. Audi also offers a spectrum of other options to conveniently suit all sorts of drivers. For example, there's the premium package which features a sunroof and upgraded 17-inch wheels. There's the cold weather package, which will allow you to go skiing, providing you live in a place cold enough. In the back, you'll have space for your skis, and up here, you'll have seats that will cozy up your bums. For audio files, there's the audio package, which features a Bose stereo system and Sirius satellite radio. And then, on top of all that, there's the convenience package, which, well, may very well define the word itself. It just so happens that this particular car I'm driving is equipped with each and every one of those add-ons. Numbers are also a part of this car's essence. There are 200 turbocharged horsepowers, 207 pound-feet of thrusting torque, and you also get a fuel economy which can exceed 30 miles per gallon. Driving along, it's none of the numbers that stand out, nor is it the convenience of a single option. What does stand out is its capability to achieve all that it does without leaving a sour taste of disgust in the mouths of those who see these daytime running lights in the rear view of their Kia Spectra. The Audi A4 is so comfortable, convenient, and good, yet not so offending as its fellow German competitors. I'll give it to you this way. BMW claims to build the ultimate driving machine. That is a bold statement, and it's obnoxiously arrogant. Mercedes-Benz declares to build the best or nothing. That is a good claim for them, but it's narrowly unforgiving. Audi, on the other hand, they proclaim truth in engineering. Truth. Yeah.